Hey everyone, welcome to a new OpenRC2 update video. Now there have been a few fun new updates uh, in OpenRC2. In this video I will discuss a few of them. Now um, a few uh, days ago I asked the developers of the game uh, why the minimum limit uh, for the map size was 13 by 13 tiles. Um, and the response that I got was basically um, that that was always the limit. And yeah, it actually was very easy for them to actually make it smaller. So uh, that's uh, what happened uh, within a few hours after I asked that, or actually within one hour, we actually already had smaller maps. So uh, <laughs> yeah, that was actually a very fun uh, update. So uh, here you can see the new minimum map size is three by three tiles. It's enough to allow for a park entrance and a spawner. And uh, you still have a little bit of park area behind it. As you can see, I have an amazing park here right now. Yeah, if you want to make uh, smaller maps than 13 by 13, it's actually a feature that I will use a lot because uh, we often do mini contests and then we often have maps of 10 by 10 or 5 by 5. Uh, it's actually really fun to do. So yeah, I'm uh, really happy with this update. Now, another update that we got is that several tracks have been added to the game. Um, so yeah, I will just quickly build a ride. Now, if you want to uh, enable these new tracks, you go to the object selection and we click advanced. And then here you can see the music tab and oh, I, let's see, I don't want to select it only. Let's also disable this filter. So uh, here you can, I uh, now have the OpenRC2 official filter enabled and here you can see the tracks that have been added to the game by the OpenRC2 team. Uh, these tracks were all made by uh, Yalman, you can see the name here, also known as Aura Specs or Karst. Uh, but yeah, he made all these tracks, uh, you can see Asset Style, Dutch and Speed Style 2, Galaxy Style. I already uh, discussed these in a previous video, uh, you should check it out if you haven't heard them yet. Or you can just listen to them in-game. And uh, in this update, the Extraterrestrial Style and the Blizzard Style have been added. Now, um, the eventual goal of this uh, music is that they will um, yeah, replace the original uh, music, but only for people who don't have the original game. Right now, you still need the original Rollercoaster Tycoon 2 to uh, yeah, be able to play OpenRCT2. That's because uh, OpenRCT2 still uses the graphics and sound from the original game. But in the future, uh, yeah, the goal is that you can play the game without the original uh, sounds and graphics and then uh, these music styles are what you get of course if you have the original game you can just listen to these uh, in addition to the original uh, soundtracks now i think these uh, additions are great so uh, yeah i will just uh, let you hear a short clip uh, of both of these tracks so first off uh, let's start with blizzard style Right, uh, this was uh, Blizzard style, or at least a part of it. Uh, I won't let you hear the entire track in this video. Uh, you can listen to it uh, yourself um, in OpenRST2. Now, and there's another track called Extraterrestrial Style. Um, I'll also let you hear a small clip of it. All right, that was the extraterrestrial style. Now, I think this is a real cool addition to the game. Definitely a fun track. Now, personally, I always play with sound off, so I probably won't make use of this, uh, or at least not much. But still, uh, I think it's always great to have additions like these to the game, and especially in the future uh, when people might be playing this game without the original uh, assets. 
um, yeah, it will be good to have some really nice uh, music in the game. All right, uh, well, that was it for this uh, update. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it's useful, and I'll see you again in the next video. See you later.